All right, guys, Wolf Lewis here, back with another match day vlog. It's a very wet, wet Wednesday night, and country for a Wednesday night. It's not Champions League football, it's Europa League football, of course, with this new, what is it, 32 36. team? 36. 36 league. Everything's staggered, seemingly, on random yeah, dates. It's a bit more interesting, isn't it? Yeah. Um, uh, who are we playing today? Wait, wait a minute, wait a minute. Uh, five. 10, 5 times 4, 15, 20. 20. So you were playing tonight. Or Twenta. Or Twenta. 20 or whatever, FC 20? Twenta probably. Twenta. Words. Twenta. Um, Dutch team. Um, Doing all right. Yeah, not bad. The fourth in the Eredivisie, are you going to call it? Yeah. Dutch league. Um, uh, the Dutch Farmers League. Uh, I think they'd be doing all right. I think they, didn't they've won... Uh, I think they won the last game 5-0 away. And well, I was, thought it was a yeah, I did statement look, performance. I briefly looked. Uh, and I think they, they haven't been letting a lot of goals in, so... Mm -hmm. uh, no household names in there, I don't think. Um, some strange Dutch spelling names. Yeah. Ricky Van Wolfswinkel. People like that. Um, so, yeah, it's obviously Ten Hag's going to be familiar with these guys. Uh, 20 fans were at the, uh, the Etihad, the small stadium last night, mm -hmm. uh, watching City, weren't they? <laughs> and causing a bit of trouble, I think. Yeah, um, I've seen some footage of them in the city yeah, centre they, earlier. I think they're all going to be marching up uh, mm -hmm. towards Old Trafford. Yeah, probably, uh, what, now? With their flares yeah. and, and and the pancakes Whatever. and stuff, so it uh, should be interesting. Good atmosphere, uh, hopefully. Yeah, with it, with it being a different format, it's going to be interesting. Uh, it's important to get, come away, obviously, with your home game with three points, yeah. um, and then move on. So, I guess a bit of an unknown quantity. I don't know much about mm. about them. I've not really done much homework. So, yeah, I think we need to to go go there with eyes wide open. It's going to be uh, tricky with the conditions um, off the back of a, a frustrating yeah. uh, uh, nil nil with Palace. Um, obviously, we. We've not been con conceding, uh, but we did come unstuck with goals on uh, over the weekend. So it's important. We've got we've got uh, Spurs on Sunday. Yeah, in the league. So uh, it's important tonight to get that momentum back, get some goals in there. Who he's gonna who he's gonna pick? Obviously, there'll be he'll make a couple of changes. I would have thought with one eye on with one eye on the uh, the Tottenham games and massive games. So mm, yeah. Uh, be interesting to see who picks, but you have to get off to a winning start, though, in this. Yeah, it's 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 important that we we uh, we we you know we can't be left behind and and end up having to uh, do playoffs for this thing. So yeah, further down the line. So prediction, it's going to be a tough one. I'm not too sure what to predict. To be fair, uh, I think they're capable of giving us a headache. Mm -hmm. I, it could even be a draw. Uh, I'm going to go two two. Don't you can what, read my mind. No, no joke. I was going to go for two. two. Again, yeah, you know, the conditions may dictate. Otherwise, it might be a uh, might be a dull nil nil. But can we win? Yes, I'd like to. Can we? Can we see it being a, a, a tricky fixture? Yeah. So I'm going two two. What about you? You stole my prediction. I'm going to go you two. I'm going to go two two as well. Honestly, I can't. I can't think of another of another result. I mean. I mean, it, where would you rank them in? I suppose Premier Premier League uh, teams. Would, would you put them as like? I, a, I don't. To be honest with you, I've not watched you know, a game or not even watched any highlights. So you know, don't, I don't know what. I mean, we can't underestimate them. You know, I mean, everyone's obviously. It's not the best league, I suppose, Euro Divisi, but mm. you can't write them you off. You get what you get in the Europa League. Yeah, so, uh, it's tough. Tough yeah, game tonight. A couple of a uh, couple of Desmond Tutus. Let's go. <laughs> Alright guys, here's tonight's starting eleven. So in goal, Anana, Masrari, Maguire, Martinez, Fernandez who's captain, Ashford, Xerxy, Ericsson, Ahmad, Dallo and Ugarte, and on the bench, Brian Deer, Heaton, Delict, Evans, Casemiro, Collier, Mainu, Mount, Anthony, Garnacho, Hoyland. Come on United, get a few goals tonight. Yeah, that's it. 
So just to the left of me is where the entrance of the uh, FC20 fans are. They're all obviously in a group marching towards the stadium. It's well, just over half an hour till kickoff. I'm assuming they're all inside because they like to get these fans in nice and early. Um, a bit quiet around here at the moment. Good pass into the box and side foot just wide. First big chance.
minute of the half. It's um, not 20 nil, by the way. It's not. I think not 20 I, nil. I think like 20 one -nil. and a bit more oomph and precision going forward. They might actually do something with it because they've shown signs, but we've just taken control. Look, we could have put two, three past them if we actually try and not walk the ball in. Nice finish from Ericsson. Um, I think we just need to see this game off. It probably sounds a bit naive, but, you know, like I say, 20 have been going forward, but they've not shown mass signs and nah, we just need to get a few more goals, man. They had the early chance, didn't they? Uh, but other than that, there's been nothing really. It's, yeah, it's, it's been... United have done what they, they had to do. They've knocked yeah. on the door. Uh, it's not been pretty to watch in parts. It's been lively. Rashford's been, been quite lively, guys. He's had a lot of the ball. Quite a few corners. Well taken goal by Ericsson. Uh, not, they're not really posing a threat. I mean, unless something dramatically changes in the second half. I don't see them getting a the goal, but having said that, it only takes one stupid mistake. I think we've got them under control at the back, but if we start doing things a bit daft, a few misplaced passes, they've got a bit of space, so keep on going. I mean, well, let's just get over the line, let's get the three points. Yeah, we can get another one, great, but let's just play, play it nice and cool, no injuries, and move on to Sunday. Let's get your job done tonight, come on. chances and put the game to bed this is what happened but it was a mistake that cost us the goal I, I can't blame anyone I think it was Ericsson but I mean we should be playing this team to bed I don't blame Ten Hag there's a strong enough team out there who made the good changes and we couldn't see them off 20 fair play for them they're celebrating like they've won the league but I mean if this is the quality we're at we're for a long season you know I, uh, fans have enjoyed their fans have enjoyed it but it's just off to a bad start, just like last year's Champions League campaign. 
I don't want to feel negative, but it is what it is. And like I say, we're going to have to fix things, otherwise, like I say, we're, we're in for a long one. Games worth of the trams in one of the ones around. Okay. 